Hello everyone, it is Thanksgiving and it is time for Draw at Home with Tupperberry Art to draw a turkey. So let's draw that butterball on the plate in time for the feast. Let's start off with a curved line or a rainbow-like line. On top of that, we're gonna add the drumstick. That drumstick is gonna have a teardrop-like shape, but don't close it off. At the top, we'll have multiple lines that come to a point because this is where the bone comes out. Watch what I do here. I round out one side of the bone and then round it out on the other side, bringing it back to our drumstick. Then we're gonna do this again, but it's going to be the leg behind. So we don't wanna see that much of it and it's going to be a little bit smaller. So do that same approach with the skin and then now with our bone, we round out the left side, bring another line, rounding out, making it look like it is behind. You can come back, erase the lines you don't need Curve out the line on the bottom, completes the turkey, and now we can put this guy on a plate. When you draw the line for the plate, start that line just a little bit above the bottom of the turkey and finish around the same point. I like to draw thin little lines to give the plate a little bit more shape. Now we're gonna add the trimmings on the plate. So this could be fruits or vegetables. I'm gonna start off with doing a piece of lettuce or some lettuce underneath the turkey. So you'll notice I'm rounding out my lines, but then having them come to a point, multiple points to give it that lettuce look. Next, we can throw in some circles. These can either be tomatoes or they could be potatoes. So we'll throw in a few circles right on top of the turkey and then the line behind We'll just remember to erase that line or color over it. That way it looks like our vegetables, our fruit, is sitting right in front of our turkey. I'm throwing in a little bit of some fruit slices. You can add whatever it is you like. And the last thing I'm gonna add is little sprigs of an herb, like rosemary, which is just like little branches. First draw the stem, and then you can have your little lines come from the center off. I'll throw in a few more of those, and then we're ready to color. So get those colors ready, because it's time to color. And remember, use multiple shades. Add several different browns, so you have lights and darks, and several different greens, too. And it'll help your images pop off the page. And that's a wrap for this Butterball. Thank you so much for doing another Draw at Home video with Tupperberry Art. If you like this video, remember to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, come back and do another drawing video with me, and we'll see you again.